Happy holidays. Merry Christmas. Happy Diwali, everybody. I'm Peter Clausey with Investor Intel. You can tell from the jacket. Uh, today, we have a new guest of Panther Metals and Darren Hazelwood. We haven't heard this story before, and it's a good story. Hi, Darren. Thanks for coming. Hi, Peter. It's been a pleasure joining you. My, my apologies for not for not quite being able to match this, the, the season's jacket that, 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 and the attire that you, you hold, but uh, I'm, I'm super jealous here, Peter. So, uh, <laughs> Panther Metals is in a few places around the world. Uh, Panther trades in London. Not in Canada, so not a lot of people have heard the story, but it's a good story in the Hemlo region and in Australia. So tell us first, what assets do you have in Hemlo? So we've got the Dotted Lake properties, about 16 kilometers north of the Hemlo mine. We've recently drilled there. It's the first drill hole, that's, it's the first serious drill hole that's gone in. It was 400 meters, 402 was the exact final figure. Here on the property, Few, good few years back, uh, Naranda sunk 300 meter holes, and um, that that was some distance away from the, the, the current spot that we're at. So, there, so lots of work has been done on that property historically, and I'm sure there were strong historical indications. As so, that's why you picked it up. Oh, absolutely. There's, there's been two. There's been two companies previously at the exact set point that we're at, and both of them come away with reports recommending this area needs drilling every indication is that there is something going on on this sector we've we've actually identified through further programs this summer six different areas within the close vicinity and also we now know that we're we're, we're on a gold bearing shear zone that's running for 1.6 kilometers and we've drilled it and we've drilled it to depth because we think that um that i'm from the shear zone may then move into Gabbro. You've got Palladium one that was success have been very successful in the, in the area as well. So we're kind. Of, this is a whole about the stratigraphy, understanding really what's going on in, in those rocks. Okay. So when you say at depth, how far down did you go? Four hundred two. Oh, that okay. total depth, and um, we're, we're 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 waiting on assays now, and that was the whole point. And that's why we wanted to we wanted to go through the shear zone, really get. A a broad understanding of what's happening. Okay, yeah. so uh, Panther Metals, you also have a property in Australia. Yeah, well, we've just recently, in fact, approximately two weeks ago, we, we listed off our Australian assets on the ASX in a completely separate vehicle. We retained 36.6% .6 of that vehicle, and that's to allow us to focus totally on, on, on Dotted Lake, Big Bear Project, which is just north of uh, the North Shore deposit, actually, in, in Schreiber. And also with the Abonga Greenstone Belt, that we've, we've done a deal recently with, with Leanne Boya uh, and, and her company. So that enables us to entirely focus, for the first time in the company's life, on exploration and, and discovery. And that's what we're going for. There's a geologist in Ontario named Francine Long. And Francine is a big fan of your property that's just north of that North Shore. She quite likes it. Yeah, yeah. No, Francine's a, she's she's a lovely girl, and um, she's she's been a big supporter, and that's much appreciated. In fact, we've got a lot of support in Canada, hence this interview, Peter. Is, <laughs> and we we get more interest from Canada with what we've got than, than London, and yeah, um, I think that's that, that's probably reflective on the fact that you know, as you'd expect, Canadians understand Ontario and they understand the prospectivity of it, and um, and we certainly do, and we, we're really excited for what we've got. Well, it's funny because I've actually walked your property. I know Francine has, other people have. Uh, we're on good relations with First Nations there, as are you, and you've, you've walked the property with them. So a lot of people have actually been on your properties. Yeah, yeah, yeah. No, we, we, that's that's one side that we, we have to hold our hands up. Being, and it, being a UK company and understanding the, the, the intricacies with the First Nations and, and how to build those relationships. And that's something that we're working on all the time. And um, I, I'm, I'm the first to hold my hands up and say that we wouldn't have the expertise that, that maybe some others in Canada would, um, but, but we're developing that and we're developing our knowledge. And, uh, but we come to the table with, with a completely open mind and, and an understanding. A, a basic understanding and and that stood us in, in pretty good stead but we, we've still got a lot of work to do but but we're actively wanting to push that forward and, and and build on those relationships good how many shares does panther have outstanding 
but we, we we've got approximately 67 million we come yeah. to market in january of 2020 um, we had 48 million then we've, we've currently got about 67 million and and we've we've purposely kept kept i've purposely kept tight control of, of our capital structure and we've mentioned great bear that's what chris taylor did with great bear until till they made that discovery it, it they you keep control of your capital structure to enable you to push on right at the very moment you need to that way you you're pulling along your existing shareholders they're seeing the capital growth and as the company seeing the capital growth it's not just being diluted by the issue in a stock to enable you to to, to move through the, through the next level. If, if you do it right and keep it as tight as you can in those yep. early phases of, of the business. How much cash do you have in the bank? We've got enough to last us through through, through to our work, proposed work programs into next summer. Darren, always good talking with you, whether it's recorded or not. Panther Metals, trading in London. Have a look. It's a new story to you, and it's a good one. Thank you for your time. I'm Peter Claus, signing off from Investor Intel. Thanks, Peter.